In today's video, we're going to be making stuffed peppers. This is such an easy and healthy recipe to make, and it's also really versatile. You can switch it up and add different ingredients that you'd like. Here are the ingredients for my recipe of stuffed peppers. Feel free to write this down or take a picture. To start off, the first thing that we're going to do for this recipe is preheat the oven to 400 degrees Fahrenheit. While the oven is preheating, what I'm going to do is boil some water and cook my rice. This is really easy because you just can follow the directions on whatever rice package you're using. I'm using brown rice, um, but as you can see, I'm pouring in a cup of rice and then I'm going to cover it with a lid um, and let it cook. While the rice is cooking, I went ahead and got started with my peppers. So what you need to do is um, cut the top off and then um, cut the core and all of the seeds inside of the pepper. So you can see me doing that here. You can use any color bell pepper that you'd like. I stuck with all of mine as red bell peppers, but you can use any one that you like. Just make sure you get out all of the seeds and everything inside of the core of the pepper so that it is nice and empty and we can fill it up with all of our yummy ingredients. So now that our peppers are all ready to be stuffed, the next thing that I'm going to do is get my skillet ready to put the rest of the ingredients in. So I just took a medium sized saucepan and I set the stove on medium high heat and I took one tablespoon of oil. After the oil, I then went ahead and added some corn and some diced tomatoes. I thought that these two canned vegetables um, complemented this recipe perfectly, but whatever vegetables that you would like to use and incorporate into this recipe, you are more than welcome to use. I then went ahead and added some seasonings. So I used some taco seasoning, and then I also just used some salt and pepper just for some flavor. And then after all of my spices were added, I just gave it a good mix and let it sit on the stove for about five minutes until it was all nice and combined. So now that my rice is all finished, I'm going to add the rice and the beans into my already pre-mixed vegetables and seasoning. I used one cup of rice and then one can of black beans. Make sure to drain and rinse the black beans. Um, so I used one cup of the cooked rice. So what I did is once the rice was cooked, I scooped out exactly one cup and then I mixed it all together. Um, I use beans as my protein source for this recipe. Altogether, I thought that it made the most sense to use some black beans and it's really easy to make, um, but you can use any protein source that you'd like, whether it be beans or meat, whatever is your preference. So now that it is all combined, I'm now stuffing my peppers. So I stuffed them all the way up to the top. Um, and just made sure it was all loaded inside of there and once I was finished stuffing all of my peppers then they were ready to go into the oven. This recipe was truly so easy to make and it is truly so healthy and it is packed with so many vegetables and a great source of protein which is beans. Um, so I absolutely recommend this recipe for anyone and it's super versatile so you can switch it up and add different things that you want to incorporate into the stuffed peppers. So once I was finished stuffing all the peppers, I put them in the oven at 400 degrees for about 20 minutes and then I took them out, sprinkled some cheddar cheese on top and put them back in the oven for about 10 minutes and this was the final product. Thank you so much for watching.